Hey, 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 Virgo, this is your sacred scribe here, ready to do your, well, extra mini read, because I told you I was going to do it in the last video, and I didn't, so I have to do this as separate. This is for Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, and North Node for Monday into Tuesday, 17th into 18th. So, you get a bonus read, Virgo. If you're interested in a personal reading, info in the description box below. Please don't forget to like, share, and subscribe as well, and comment. Let me know if this resonates with you. And they do not want me to read from the book. I asked before I started. They want me to, because I get messages through these cards. This was one of the first decks that I did get messages through the cards. It was pretty cool. So, Leap of Faith, 22. And with your last, if you didn't see Virgo's reading, please go see it, because this makes total sense. And this is 22, which is a four, and that has to do with foundations. But it's a uh, 22 is a master builder. All right, it's a master number. So let's see what this card has for you. Fly above, Virgo, what you know you can reach. Oh, that's interesting. Um, I don't know if this means anything to anybody, but they're saying seek to attune yourself. And to me, that's like connection to the universe. Yeah, that's what they're saying. Once you attune yourself, wait a minute. <laughs> Once you attune yourself, then you are going to feel balanced and fearless. And what they're showing me here is like all these sets of eyes, right? And they're actually animal eyes that I'm seeing right now. I get a lot of animals that come through cards. Oh. And it it's like you're going to be fearless, right? And taking this leap of faith, Virgo, you're going to have such a wide perspective with with all of these eyes. That's what I'm getting. Like you're going to be able to look at things from different viewpoints. And through these different viewpoints, this is after tuning to the universe. So raise that vibration up. Very cool. Okay, I could stay here all day with that card. Okay. Okay, so the next card you have, this is Nature's Whispers, by the way. Nature's Whispers. Maintain your childlike spirit. 27. Oh my God, I love swings. Do you know Ted loves swings too? I bring Ted to the park and put him in the baby swing. Um, he loves it. He's a 25 pound Shishan, if you did not know, if you've never met Ted. So this is 27. It's a nine. Nines are about endings. And I'm feeling like letting go with this, right? All right, so let's see what this one has for you. I'm getting a go with the flow with this. I'm getting actually like water, like swimming. If you ever feel restless in the coming days Virgo do something childlike because this is going to release that this is again connected to that attunement they're saying let yourself be, be vulnerable Virgo know that being vulnerable is your power it's not a fault it's it's not a kink 
in your spirit or something they're saying it's not um, something to fear it's not something to fear I'm seeing that fish again I don't know if you guys have anything to do with okay that's what I'm getting from that I love that okay and you have be gentle with yourself. Ooh, you have another master number, 33. You have a lot of synchronicity. I noticed too. I believe your video, yep, 1144. So you have 11. That was your video time. I'm like, ooh, a lot of synchronicity. Um, because in your video, it may be a twin, I believe. I, I can't remember. But you've got 11 on your video, 22, 33, and then 44. That's pretty cool. Okay, so be gentle with yourself. Let's see this. Okay. Ease into yourself. When seeking answers within, don't force it. Go easy. If you find yourself trying too hard, they're saying stop. They're reminding you that love is all around you, Virgo. Tap into not only what you are, but what's around you. You have a lot of guides around you at this time. I feel like they're, they're like circled around you and just like watching and waiting like with bated breath, right? They're wanting you to maintain a sense of calmness, this calm spirit. Because it's like in, this, in, in the presence of this calm spirit, right? In the presence of... of what you are it, it's like nothing is going to anything put in front of you that maybe would scare somebody is not going to scare you it you're not going to be fearful when you're maintaining this calm spirit It, see that there's that leap of faith again they're saying leap into the wilderness without fear with courage and what I'm getting with that is sort of like you know going into the jungle so to speak knowing that there's lions and tigers and bears oh my right but having the courage to still go even though you know what could you know the possibilities out there you're still trusting in yourself trusting in that intuition and opening your your heart space to trust all right virgo i love that for you well i hope you enjoyed this bonus reading so you have yourself a great day virgo Join me every day in the Daily Reads. If this is your first time here, I do all 12 signs um, on YouTube. So please drop a like, share, and subscribe right down below there. If you haven't already, comment. Let me know if this resonates with you. And also, if you're interested in a personal reading, info is in the description box. Have a good one, Virgo, and I'll talk to you soon. Namaste.